Hey fellow Vault Winners, it's Angry Tartul, and before we jump into the video, I want to send my thanks to all of you subscribing, giving me those likes and positive comments, I really appreciate that, and special thanks to all my Patreons that are supporting my channel, and I want to welcome my latest Patreon, I'm not welcome, we truly appreciate your support, we are happy to have you on our Patreon, thank you a lot. In this video, we'll be testing if my troubleshooter set can be upgraded and I basically have full set of troubleshooter I can show you guys uh, this one is with sentinel chest piece this one is with cavalier uh, this piece is just AP refresh and this one is with sentinel as well and one more with sentinel and AP refresh all five pieces of troubleshooter and now I have this mask that I can add on top of everything. And question is, can it stack higher than I already have with all those effects? As regular robots are doing already nothing versus my set, then I decided to summon Imposter to test, test this with him. Let's call him. Before Imposter will join us, that's a quick overview of my build. Uh, it's uh, my, generally it's my bloody heavy gunner build, but I swap some perks to fight the imposter without uh, power armor and therefore I have this adamantium skeleton, I have some rejuvenated steel lone wonder, oh this is supposed to be replaced, but that I decided to check that it should be tenderizer if I will decide to kill him later. Oh he's here, let's see what's going on, why am I on fire? Looks like fire is doing some damage to me, if we're looking on my health it's actually getting hit by imposter and it's look that yep i need to use a steam pack yeah he's able to do visible damage on me but question is will it be less damage if i actually use some mask on me okay let's add the mask face mask radicals face mask am i doing better now He's going ham on me. It's hard to definitely say, actually. I'm afraid that can be similar. Where is he? Come fight me. Fight me, imposter. It is laser beam. Yeah, I'm surviving the laser beam quite well, I will say. I don't know which attack is this fire attack from him. Maybe it's actually helping. He's trying really hard now. Before... Okay, let's unequip the mask now. Unequipping the mask. Is he doing any better? Or is it the same? Honestly, I cannot tell. Let's put the mask back in. I'm afraid it can be about the same. Okay, I have something else I can add. I have uh, live and laugh number 9. It's minus 20% damage from robots. Will it break everything or it does nothing? Let's see. Let's consume it. Am I doing better now? No, I don't think so, guys. I think it's exactly the same. The mask seems to be a waste. I'm not doing any better. It would be probably good to actually try and kill him. If I already summon him in here, then let's, let's do it. Let's consume some additional steam. Let's grab those pylons. Uh, and I don't think Troubleshooter is doing anything versus pylons. Actually, pylons just drain your health regardless what you are doing. Then unfortunately, I can counter it with my set. Oh, what's that? All the robots are waiting over there. You saw that, guys. All the robots. Okay, I'm getting too much rats. And I actually wanted... To... Oh! How did he kill me now? I think that uh, drain from pylons actually make him kind of stronger. As he was able to annihilate my health bar. And before he was pretty much struggling to achieve anything. 
Okay, let's do another approach. Grab those pylons. Don't forget the steams this time around. And do I have anything like in aid? Uh, my steams. Oh, Scorch Beast food. That will last for a little bit longer as I want some photo of him. Can I do it? Come on, don't move, imposter. Okay, because my steams will stop working soon. This photo will need to do it. Or are we going for another one? But as you can see, this set is working quite well, but it's looked like I can pretty much replace one of my pieces with this mask or something, because I don't see any benefits of going above 75% damage reduction. I'm not getting any better. It's time to kill him now. Don't forget to use some steams occasionally. And it's actually a bloodied, uh, bloodied heavy gun I'm using. I'm doing more damage when I'm losing health. Oops, almost died. But didn't actually. That's important. And this fire damage is actually quite dangerous, even though I have fireproof free. I was expecting this fire with a troubleshooter set to do about nothing, but it's actually doing more than attacks from him. And those other robots are doing basically like nothing to me. All that's doing damage to me are those pylons and trouble uh, and imposter himself. All those other robots I can almost ignore with my set. Come on, we need to finish you. I started this video, everyone want to see you dying, imposter. Oh, that's unexpected turn of events. My gun broke. We have some complications. Okay, gun is fixed. I took some additional stims. Oh, 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 no, 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 don't die on me. Don't die on me. Okay, now we're doing well. Imposter, you're supposed to die, not me. You die. Yep. That's exactly what we wanted. Regenerating Rider chest piece. Okay, if we are already here, let's see how all those remaining robots can do. Look, my... They're killing themselves. <laughs> Actually, my perk that I'm rocking, Ricochet, is killing them. They're gonna kill themselves by shooting me. Eventually. Look at that, they, they, some of them lost a lot of health already. The unlucky ones, probably the Ballistic Guts is losing much more health than Laser Guts, as Laser Guts are not doing anything. And they're breaking my armor pieces. But apart from that, they're not doing too much damage to me. And I don't think the magazine or mask is doing anything. Let's see if I take off some of my apparel pieces, like chest piece. And what's not broken yet? Right arm. Maybe there is a difference. Yeah, if I... Yeah, you see, there is a difference. If I took out two pieces, there is a difference. But if I add the third piece, it's about the same. Then five pieces of troubleshooter, it's about everything you can get. That's what we learned from this video. I kind of wasted the role on this troubleshooter mask. Unless I want to replace like chest with something else with other effect, like auto steam will be good. Oh, actually, it's not total waste. I can just take auto steam chest or something like that, more universal, or keep my unyielding without changing it. Yeah, it's not a total waste. I can use it. I can just replace one of other pieces with something else. Okay, time to finish those robots. They don't want to finish themselves. And although some of them are really close, this protector almost died. This colonel guts is almost done. Yeah, it's the first time that I almost killed a bunch of robots with a perk card without actually shooting them. Oh, there's more robots. Yep, I can tank all of you with troubleshooter. So bad that you cannot stack it. Oh, this one is legendary. Everyone probably want to see what you dropped. Vampire's Guitar Sword. Oh, it's actually good, with faster swing speed. And if you are struggling with Imposter Event, 
Now you know what to do. You just find yourself five pieces of troubleshooter armor, whatever pieces, and you'll be just fine like in here. Just don't go for any more. All this additional magazine, the mask, it's not going higher than 75% it's looked like from this test, because if this will go higher than 75%, it should be tremendous difference. Between, because if, like quick math, <laughs> that's quick final math. If Imposter will be doing, let's say, 100 damage, it will be reduced by my set to 25 damage. Then, if I will add another piece, it's supposed to be reduced to 10 damage. Then between 10 damage and 25 damage, it's a huge difference, should be visible without any problem. And I couldn't see difference. This means that six pieces doesn't work. You only want five, 75% seems to be the cap. And I was getting as slow as it was possible then with five pieces, then six piece, it was a waste. But anyway, thank you a lot for watching and see you guys in another episode of Tartus Lab.